Titanic gaming The channel where Logan will show you everything From gameplay to gear, their crew is here To take you on a journey through every atmosphere Releases to news, you don't have to choose Red Bandana Gaming is here for you Hey everybody! Logan here! Yeah! Today, we're finally doing an unboxing for something I actually bought a few weeks ago. But I've been saving it, I haven't opened it yet, and I've been dying to open it, but I couldn't really do it, uh, use it, I should say, until my whole setup was set up. Uh, it's still not complete, I'm still the plain white window. Mmm, that ain't gonna do. Got a surprise coming. And honestly, right now I'm sitting on the ground. I haven't got my couch in for the game room for all the videos that we're going to be doing in here. Until then, you've seen my office, you've seen my recording setup. But now, this is going to be the game room. This is where I'm going to do a lot of the gaming featured stuff. Uh, the, the products, the gameplay, stuff like that. You're going to see me focused in this room, which is basically 2.0 of the original Red Bandana Gaming game room. But... I've been jabbering on long enough. What you guys clicked on the video to see is the unboxing for... Boom! Yeah, you guys see it. Even though the Retron, uh, Retron 5 has been out for a while, this is the, I guess you could say the latest model that has the, what I call the Miami Vice colors. I think it's just called Vice. Uh, I can't remember what the special edition, it's just a special edition. I saw somewhere where it said, uh, there we go, included Hyper Beach Scout Controller. So this is called Beach, Hyper Beach. So that's what the color is. It's very flashy for my taste, but I love the Miami Vice colors, not gonna lie. Uh, the new uh, Retron SQ that's coming out, it should be in a couple days as of recording. You guys see my last video on it. Um, I'm really looking forward to this. I like the color. I'm going to pick that one up. I'm going to do an unboxing for that as well. Uh, I know there are a couple people out there that got the, I, I guess, the early access to it. I wasn't lucky enough. But when I saw this, I do have the Super Retron HD, the Mega Retron HD, and the Retron HD, which is the Sega Genesis uh, Master System 1, sorry, Sega Genesis Mega Drive 1, my mistake, Super Nintendo slash Super Famicom and NES uh, versions of the Retron all uh, standalone to look more like their uh, respectable systems. This one has everything in one as well as uh, Game Boy Advance. So this uh, plays Game Boy games too. So I decided, what the heck, let me get the all-in-one, gonna make it easier when I start doing uh, video recordings and stuff like that, to just have one device. So, if I bought this in the first place, I would've saved money. But, those other Hyperkin devices are awesome. And as you guys have seen by watching my channel, I like Hyperkin. I really like their stuff. No, I'm not paid by them. No, it's not an ad. I just love this stuff. Uh, and I'm waiting for their Nintendo 64 one, Hyperkin. Get that Nintendo 64 out already! But, enough jabbering on. You guys want to see this open. I'm sure you've seen the other ones, but let's see. It's all about this one and those beautiful Vice City colors. Yes, and it doesn't hurt that I'm from Miami, so... Yeah, I've seen those colors before. But, without further ado, let's get this baby open. Yeah, so there we go like the rug yeah this is the rug in the center of the game room again since i don't have the couch and the little table i will be doing everything on i'm not using the same one that i had before i'm getting an, a nice little uh coffee table uh to do all my unboxings on and give you a better view so now let's pop over open my new little knife now it's okay it's a little bigger than the original but hey so is the game room everything gets an upgrade Any extra tape? No. So, I'm sure you guys have seen Retron 5 box openings before. These aren't new products. 
but like I said, the color is. So, and for me, this is brand new. And I actually, see it says multiple system compatibility, compatibility, sorry, Game Boy Advance, Famicom, NES, Super NES slash, I guess, Super Famicom, and Genesis and Mega Drive. Now, from my understanding, it even plays Game Boy and Game Boy Color. Oh, look at that. Nifty. That's an interesting looking machine we got there. So that's the GBA. So SNES 2, NES 2, Genesis 2. Huh, I have to look up what that means. I wonder if that means if you you swap it over to um Oh no, these are the control reports for the second player. Oh. Oh, so each player's on the side. Ah, I get it. And got your power. Very NES looking. What is this part for? Does it show it on the box? Oh, no, it doesn't. I think that's for holding the controllers. Kind of Famicom-y, I guess, but Famicom had them on the side. Let's see what's on the back here. So, what is that? What does that say? Uh, memory. Oh, so you can update with uh, an SD card. Mm, micro SD? Is that the mini? Micro. HDMI. I wonder what this used to be. It's probably there for a reason. But power. So, pretty straightforward unit. Okay, those are pretty solid. Uh, not having the eject buttons, I get, but I was always a big fan of uh, the eject. I love that color scheme. So, of course we have our HDMI cable, power cable, USB. Oh, adapters, depending on where you're using them. That's cool. And then these are the controllers. This is, oh, so that's why it also costs so much. It came with a wireless one. This I don't have. I wonder if this works with a switch as well. Oh, it reminds me of that NES pad. Mm. Ooh, not a big fan of the way that feels. Uh, this is the only one that I've ever heard people complain about. I get it. It's okay. I'll try this out. Definitely try this out. See how that one goes. But this is the best one. This Scout. This is such a good SNES variant. I use this on the Super um, Super Retron. It's solid. It feels great. It's very responsive. Haven't had any problems with these whatsoever. So awesome controllers. This is definitely the best. It's worth every penny. And then we got the Hypokin sticker. Yes. Yes, those are cool. Like Hyperkin, stick one more sticker on the laptop and then all the warranty information. And there you go. So that's the unboxing. So look forward to many, many retro videos coming uh, like we used to do. Because yeah, I miss those. And for some reason, my original Retron HD did not uh, like to work with the, um, the Elgato. So hopefully this one will. I've heard that nothing but uh, positive things about this one. Uh, I haven't heard any issues with its compatibility with the Elgato. So I guess we put those there. There, I don't know. Does that go something like, okay, I guess that goes like that. I guess it's meant to go like that. So, there you go. Now, look forward to uh, 
a game room tour coming up soon once I get that the, the, the couch in here. Got the new TV. Uh, got uh, everything else set up. I'm just looking for those blinds. Those curtains. Curtains. It's it's curtains for you, see? Um, the curtains and, yeah, like I said, the couch. Everything else is, is on point. Then you'll get a 2020 game room tour and you'll get to see this all connected. But thank you guys so much for watching. Remember, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, share this video with everybody because this thing is awesome. Thank you guys so much. Head on over to redbandanagaming.com, hit that subscribe button. Wait, didn't I ever say that? Yeah, maybe I already did. But uh, visit us on our so socials. Make sure you hit that link in the description at Teespring where you can buy some shirts and stuff. That's really cool. Thank you guys so much. Yeah, subscribe. Like what I always say, be legendary. Thanks again.